That's what we're supposed to be boiling and drinking. Terry Hall says she's lived in Jackson her whole life and is fed up with the water issues after seeing what was dripping from her faucet this week. So I started dripping water to fill the bathtub back up. And in the bottom of the bathtub is sediment, like a lot of sediment. We've got water pressure, but that's it. At her Fondren home, water pressure is still too low to take a shower or wash clothes. But Hall says she tried to fill up her tub to have water to flush her toilet and wash dishes with. We can't bathe in that water because if there's microbes in it, they can enter through your mouth or your nose um, or your it was, eyes. It was an so sure. we're having to go somewhere else to bathe. Can't wash dishes because you don't want that stuff on your dishes either because then you ingest it that way. Pressure is slowly returning, but Hall says even with a boil water advisory, she feels it's not safe. Well, you can't boil what's in what I see in my we water out of the water. She says the infrastructure of Jackson has suffered too long and wants it fixed. Somewhere, somebody's got to take control of this and start working on the infrastructure instead of just blaming it on the act of God. Yeah, it's going to be expensive, but that's what we pay our taxes for. Hall has now been without water for over 10 days. Allie Ware, 16, WAPT News.